Good morning, Arizona. Gibby Parra here at the Arizona Animal Welfare League. You know, there's a reason why they've already saved 2,000 uh, 70 lives this year, dating back to January, Whitney. And the reason why is you guys find uh, people to work with, and in this case, a mill that saves dogs, and they came here. You guys took in about a dozen. Three of them have already been adopted. Emmy has had some work. She's almost ready. Emmy Empanada, and look at her poor Emmy. She's been through a rough life as it is already. But here's the thing. You guys have found a way to keep these dogs going, because if not, the fate they would have had it would not have been a good one. Right. So the outcome for a mill dog is not ideal. Um, essentially, once they are stopped being able to produce litters, then the mills typically dispose of them. So National Mill Dog Rescue um, actually goes in and gets these animals, and then we're able to pull from them and bring them down. So we just got 12 dogs in. Emmy is one of them. They're beautiful dogs, but they do all need a lot of work. So that can either be medically, like in Emmy's case, where she had to have double eye surgery, so she's still got her suture in there, um, or behaviorally, where they're just not used to kind of living in the real world. And sometimes it's both of those things. So they do take a while to become adoptable. So basically, here's what you guys have to remember, that if you do decide and you want to come in here and you see a dog like Emmy and they are part of the mill litter that came in here, you have to remember there's extra care. There's special care. You're, there's a package you're going to have to fill out. It's unlike the original forms you come in because you're really going to have to think about this. Right. A lot of people see these dogs and they're, you know, quote unquote, purebred dogs, ones that they've loved their entire life and they love the look of them, but they're not necessarily used to the medical and behavioral stuff. So we actually do have a packet that we want you to read. A lot of it talks about the behavior stuff as well as potty training. These dogs have lived in a crate their entire lives because that's what the mill has deemed acceptable. And they might have never mastered potty training. Some of them might pick it up. Some of them might not. I mean, Emmy's seven years old and she's lived her entire life that way. So um, to break those habits is going to be really hard and you have to be patient. All right. The Arizona Animal Welfare League with poochers just like Emmy here. If you have the time, Emmy will... Love your place to be with. Look at this. How can you resist? We'll have more coming back on Good Morning Arizona. Look at that Aww. face.